guys oh my god okay um where do i start first of all we're gonna be doing my makeup today because it's 2024 what can i say this youtube channel is long overdue i have had a youtube channel before i have posted videos before but 2024 is going to be my YouTube year because I said so. <laughs> so let's do my makeup today and chit chat about what my channel is going to be like, what we're going to do on here, what I'm going to do on here. So in this video, I'm not going to talk too much about the products I'm using. Um, I'll be doing kind of like makeup lifestyle vlog type of videos um that will later like i'll later have like an everyday makeup routine that i'll post with like all of my um daily like everyday products um exactly what i'll use every single day something to note about me is that i am a rare beauty connoisseur i love my rare beauty um it's literally my f one of my favorite makeup brands i've been using it for like the past two years and i just feel like i am one with selena i'm honestly just so excited about just getting this youtube channel started and being able to just to chat and be a girl and i have always loved doing these kind of thing but i've just never fully committed and been like you know what, like, I'm just gonna full-on become a YouTube girly, but it's time. Please note that though I am doing YouTube, I'm not an influencer, and <laughs> I'm also not, like, doing this, like, full-time. Like, I am a normal girl. Um, I have an 8 to 5, so my channel's basically gonna be very, like, lifestyle. We're gonna do our makeup, we're gonna get ready for work, we're gonna go on coffee dates, and just have a good time and be you know normal girls my videos will probably be really realistic because i have a very normal life i don't even know how to put that but i do let's brush these brows there's literally so many things that i am excited for in 2024 that rhymed not really it was the same word but aside from like youtube and stuff um my other goals were to get a new car which i got um literally two days ago but i have not picked it up again normal girl activities i didn't go and like buy a freaking benz i like to set my face after every step. That's just me though. I just feel like it keeps everything dewy, you know what I mean? Anyways, before I interrupted myself, um, yeah, I did not get a Benz. I did not get a freaking Maserati, but I did get a Maserati. I got a Mazda and it's a car that I've been wanting for literally the longest time. And, um, I live on my own. I kind of have been very independent since I graduated college and it's just been rough out here. So I just haven't been able to get a new car. And the car that I do have, um, currently is a little Kia Soul that my father got me for college. Um, and my baby has... 200,000 miles on it it actually has exactly 190,000 but like she has gone through everything with me she went through college with me she's gone through like a million jobs with me we've done it all in that little car to be honest but it's honestly just time for it to go because it's had so many issues 
not even just recently just always like it's always had so many issues but it's always been so faithful to me and it's always gotten me everywhere i need to go and it's never failed me so i stuck to her for a long time and now it's she's giving up on me i actually named her because she's a kia i named her mia the kia and mia also means mine in spanish so i thought it was so cute like my kia mia kia anyways um so i don't know what i'm gonna name my new car it is a mazda and i keep saying like oh my little mazda ratty and i think that's cute but like i need to name it so i am gonna make a video about me going to pick up my new car which i'm super excited about but yeah we can see what we're gonna name her and that'll be really fun Also important to note, I'm not a makeup artist. Like I love doing my makeup and I love learning about makeup and just like <sighs> trying out new products and just trying to just make myself look as cute as possible. Um, so I definitely love makeup, but I'm not like, I'm not like a makeup I don't know artists like that's not I'm not super good at it one thing I want to get good at in my makeup though is learning how to do a freaking wing never like I have always wanted to be a wing girly for some reason I've just never been able to and I hate that I don't know like because of my eye shape like I don't know if it's because I have like I don't even know if I have hooded eyes do I have hooded eyes like I don't know like my eyelids like are, I have a lot of eyelid space but like when I open them I think I think they're hooded right like when I open them like you can't really see my actual lids I don't know but I've tried so many eyeliner styles and I'm like not convinced that eyeliner is not for me because everyone wears eyeliner like everyone can wear eyeliner like there's no way that it's just like not for my eye type or my eye shape or whatever like there has to be a way you know but i guess we'll see and i've I've gone through so many tutorials i've gone through so many trials of doing it on myself and like figuring out maybe which type of wing like going up or going to the side or going like more you know out or down or whatever and i just can't I just can't like there's I, I can do it where to the point where like it looks okay but I've always wanted to be like snatched wing you know what I mean and it's hard my base no matter if it's winter spring summer fall is always glowy and bronzed like that's the vibe i'm always going for i've tried like i've seen so many tiktok trends where it's like um cold girl strawberry girl mocha girl i love the mocha mocha is my vibe but you know which one i want to try i want to try doing um copy and paste latina makeup if y'all didn't know y'all probably don't know but I am Latina. Um, I'm Salvadoran. I'm Mexican. I'm American. I do speak fluent Spanish. I feel like I speak Spanish a little bit more like a Salvadoran versus a Mexican just because my mom raised me. Well, so did my dad, but like <laughs> my mom raised me. My dad raised me too, but like he doesn't have like a very strong accent if you know what i mean like he doesn't have like a country accent or like maybe he does and i just don't know because i've listened to him my entire life but like i don't know like i feel like i just use slang that's more salvadoran if that makes sense and like my mom would cook so like i would just eat salvadoran food you know what i mean and yeah so even though both, I'm both, and proudly both, I just feel like I resemble a little bit more Salvadoran. 
that's just me. So yeah, there's a lot of makeup styles that I want to try doing because honestly, like my makeup is the exact same. But to do Latina, copy and paste Latina makeup, I need to learn how to do a freaking wing. I mean, not necessarily, but like, I need to know how to do a wing. I need to know how to put on lashes. Honestly, lashes is probably not the hardest thing to do, but it's still like, thing is, like, it just takes practice, you know what I mean? Like, I can do it, but if I haven't done it in a long time, then it's just not going to go well for me. But it's all about practice. And I just, like, my goal is just to be so bomb at makeup, like, I look like a celebrity when I go out, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, oh my god, that girl literally does her makeup so good. She looks like she needs paparazzi photos taken of her. That's the vibe I'm going for. But also, like, I love the clean, natural, like, not so much, like, the clean girl aesthetic, but, like, I, I really like having, like, a clean face. You know what I mean? My face favorite part of my makeup routine every day every day I don't even feel like myself if I don't put mascara on I was somehow gifted with really long curly lashes don't hate me but they're also like really crazy like they're long and curly and stuff, but like they get so crazy. Like it's so hard for me to like separate them all. Like there's no way. Like if I sat here and tried to make sure each one of my lashes was like separated from the other, like I don't think that's ever happened to me ever. But I'm gonna do a close up of my lashes because honestly my lashes are like my favorite thing on my face. I do want to try brow lamination, brow laminating, brow laminating, brow lamination. You know what I'm talking about. I want to try that because I do have thick brows and they are dark. So I feel like if I did that, that honestly would make them look better because I only use like a little brow gel, you know what I mean? And that's all, but... I'm telling you, like, my lashes, like, they're just, like, long. Like, I, I don't even know if, like, they actually look at other people, but, like, they're not all separated. These are my lashes. <sighs> my mama used to always say, like, oh, my God, you're gonna fly away. Get that a lot honestly like i said i'm gonna post an everyday makeup tutorial with all the products i'm also going to be vlogging picking up my new car i'm so excited about that and i just have so many content ideas to do for youtube this year so let me take out my clips and show you my finished everyday look so if you want to come hang if you want to come chat if you want to come have fun with me like comment subscribe baby it's a party over here